guys, welcome to Nyonya Cooking. In this video, we are going to create a meat dish and this is how to prepare Marmite Chicken. It is widely available in Chinese um, restaurants especially and this is where they call it Tai Chao where you know they cook a lot of different types of dishes where there's no menu and you need to know what's available and one of them, one of the famous dishes would be Marmite Chicken. Now Marmite is actually yeast extract and you may think it's familiar especially to those of you who are living in Australia and uh, the other version is called Vegemite. Now Marmite is really something that you might love or you might hate. I personally do not really enjoy it by itself but with this sauce because it's with honey and coat with malta so it's really sweet. I absolutely love this dish. Even as I talk about it, I think about eating it later on. So let's look at the ingredients that we need. First of all, we, I have some uh, drumsticks which I've removed the um, bones. And then I have a bit of soy sauce and also cornstarch. Now this would be used to fry the chicken later on. And for the sauces, we have a bit of honey, maltose. I left a spoon here because it's really thick. This is marmite. Shaoxing wine and also soy sauce. So let's move on to frying the chicken. First, I'm going to pour some soy sauce into the chicken. And then a bit of corn flour. Once the meat is coated with corn flour, we are going to move on to frying. So I have this pan here with a bit of oil and this is uh, heated at medium heat. So very carefully, I'm going to put these chicken pieces inside. Once we finish frying the chicken, we're going to add the rest of the ingredients into the pan and that's it. So we'll begin with a bit of soy sauce. Washing wine and I'm going to quickly put some water. Now because the rest of the ingredients are pretty thick in consistency, that is why we have to add some water to dilute them. So I added marmite, honey and lastly maltose. Now see it's so thick that it's not falling down. I'm going to let this melt in the gravy. Once the maltose is already diluted together with the honey, you'll start to see that the gravy will then caramelize. And I will now switch the stove off. And that's when we add the fried chicken in. By doing so, you get to maintain the crispiness of the chicken while having the sauce coat the fried chicken. Oh God. The dish is finally finished and this is the plate of Marmite Chicken and I think you wouldn't blame me if I were to have a bite, right? Mm. Absolutely love this. The best part, I know it's very sinful, is actually the chicken skin because it's so crispy, the skin gets crispy after it's fried and then it's coated with this delicious sweet sauce oh yeah mm. this is absolutely out of the world you have to try this recipe and meanwhile while you're watching this video give me a thumbs up I really appreciate that and share this video with your friends and family if you enjoyed it until then, remember if you have taken uh, photos of recipes that you have tried, send them on to the website of Nyonya Cooking. I'd love to see them upload them on the website. Until then, happy cooking!